Hey everybody, Allie Craig here. Let's talk about three ways to deal with those negative social media comments and we all get them. If you're on a Facebook Live, Instagram Live, or just from your post, people say the stupidest things. And what do you do when you decide you have to comment back? You see what I'm saying? Meaning that you don't always comment back. You don't always say something. Sometimes you just, you know, let a sleeping dog lie, basically, because they look more like a fool and there's no point in getting an argument with a fool. But sometimes you do actually have to say something about it. So how do you deal with it in those situations? Number one, hear the person out. Truly, most people just want to vent. So invite them to go offline. Invite them to direct message you, to give you a ring, to do anything. So that way you can get them offline to the resolution. You don't really want to have this conversation in public if they're willing to let that happen. Second thing you need to do is hear them, but, yeah, the big but is the second part of it. So you can hear them out, you repeat what they said to you, you ask, is this what you meant? They're going to say yes. So you can say, I understand, repeat their stuff. But that wasn't the point I was making. But that has nothing to do with what we're talking about. Whatever it is, you need to use the actual word but because that's part of neurolinguistic programming that helps you basically undo everything they just said that they agreed with mentally. Make sense? Lastly, you need to lovingly stand your ground. It's not about getting into an argument with somebody. It's not about going to their level. It's just not. But it also is about lovingly standing your ground. So you can have your opinion and they can have their opinion. And you keep it at that. And if they don't like your opinion, then they can, you know, please let me help you find someone else who will work for you, who will be the better consultant for you, or who is, you know, in line with what your beliefs are. I can totally appreciate your beliefs and I love you as a human being, but that's not what we do here. That's not what we're about here. But there are so many other people who are totally in line with you. And I wholeheartedly encourage you to go find them because I know you and them will be so happy together. And that's what I really want for you. It's about truly loving your audience, but still standing your ground. So if you choose that you must deal with negative social media people and negative social media comments, make sure that you hear them first, you respond to them, but, and you lovingly always stand your ground.